Okay, I will do this question. Okay, I will do this question. Okay, uh, so here you can see. Uh, <clears throat> so this is a convolution encoder. Another convolution encoder. Convolution encoder. Okay. Uh, so uh, you can see here we have one input. So we have one input n is equal to one, and we have two outputs. No, two outputs. Let's say this is uh, first output and this is second output. Okay. So, <clears throat> uh, so simple k is equal to two. Okay. Then if we calculate the rate, it is number of input divided by number of output. So that is equal to half. Okay. So it is given. Okay. And you can see that uh, <clears throat> constraint length k is equal to four. Here we have three uh, flip tops. Okay. So all these three flip tops will determine the uh, status. Okay. All these uh, flip tops will define the number of uh, status. Okay. So here we have three flip tops. Okay. Here we have three flip tops. I will uh, name them as M0, M1, M2. Okay. So you can see that uh, <clears throat> there are three uh, flip tops. So there are three bits are there. So we have eight combination. Okay. So we will have eight status. Into three flip tops, we will have eight uh, combination or status. Okay, the status. And <clears throat> uh, here also there is a one flip flops for out input. Okay, so input is uh, only one bit is given as input. So we have one flip flops there. So altogether we have one, two, three, four flip flops. That means constraint length is four. Okay. Okay. So we will <clears throat> form the table for this one. Okay. So I will get the input as i, <clears throat> okay, and we have <clears throat> three flip flops, okay. I will put them as m2, m1, m0. So these will define the status, okay. <clears throat> mm. So if I use Excel sheet, uh, I hope it is okay. No, so we have to uh, we have to construct a big table here. So I will use Excel. 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 So I hope you can see the uh, Excel screen. No, I mean, I will stop sharing again, re share. Otherwise, I'm not sure it is visible or not. Because no one here to get the feedback. Okay, now I think uh, we can see the screen. Okay. Okay. So, <clears throat> so uh, you can see that we have. You can see that we have uh, we have okay. You can see that we have one input, so I denote it as the I input, okay, and also we have uh, three. With this three bit position defining the defining the uh, status m2 m1 and m0 okay and i will put output as x1 x2 okay so this is our two outputs okay and we have the current status, current status, 
and uh, the next status. Okay. Next status. So we have these three. We have we have to find all these uh, uh, value values. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> so these are the uh, values we should uh, find out okay so you can see that we have three uh, <clears throat> uh, three flip flops defining the defining the uh, status so you can see there should be eight status and also you know that for one status there should be Two, two inputs, zero and one, okay? So I will put the <clears throat> input first here, zero, one, and we have zero, one, zero, one, zero, one, no? So it happened in series, so copy same, no? Yeah, okay, so we have zero, one, zero, one, zero, one. Uh, we should have 16, uh, no, we, we should have 16. How many we have? We have only 14. So we need another two. Okay. We need another two. Okay. So this is our input. Okay. So you can see that uh, 16 combination altogether we will have because there are eight uh, status. Okay. There are eight status and each status need two input zero and one. So altogether there are, uh, there are 16 combinations. Okay. So I will, uh, I will uh, write the status. Okay. So this, uh, so one status is zero, zero, zero. This is one status. Okay. And this should be, there should be two status. No. So I will put zero, 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 like this, okay? And you can see that uh, the other status will be zero, zero, and one, okay? So there will be again, that status will be again, there are two status. So the same status is there, okay? <clears throat> like this, okay? So you can see that here zero one one one. Okay, so I will copy them again. Okay, copy here. So I copy the same. Okay, okay. So I hope it is okay. Zero zero one one. Okay. So you can see that. Uh, so you can see that here uh, there are two status. Okay, the other status will be. 0, 1, 0, no? So again, we should have 0, 1, 0, okay? So you can see that uh, there are, this is another status, okay? So likewise, we can fill this uh, column as 1, 1, okay? And another 8, uh, 4, 0, and uh, once uh, uh, four ones okay so if i copy this i think that one is also okay okay and this should be zero 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 okay and eight should be there one two three four five six seven eight and there should be ones one 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 Okay, so there should be eight zeros and eight ones. Okay, okay. So you can see that. 
So here we have, here all together, here we have eight combination, okay, eight different combination. So this eight different combination will, uh, will give us the eight uh, status, okay. So you can see this is one status, okay. So I will put it there so you can see this is one status, okay. This is one status, okay. So I will put it as A, A, okay. So I denote this status from A, letter A, okay. And you can see this is another status, okay. So I will, I will denote it using B, okay. And you can see after this, this one, another status, no? So this is another status, so I will, I will denote it using C, okay? And here we have another status, okay? C, D, okay, I will denote it using D, okay? And you can see that here we have another status, okay? So I will put it, I will denote it using E, okay? And here we have another status, so it will be E, F, okay? F and here we have another status, okay? Here we have another status and it is, let's say it is G and this one is another status, okay? So it is F, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H. Okay, so you can see that I have eight uh, different uh, status, no? Eight different status, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight uh, combination, eight status, and each eight stat status will have two uh, cases. One is zero input, other is one, uh, uh, one of input, okay? Input as zero and input as one, okay? So, so I think uh, now, um, okay. Okay. So <clears throat> you can see that these three bits is define the current status. Okay. What, which bit will define the next status? Okay. Which, uh, which uh, will bits define the next, uh, the next status? Okay. So we know that. Okay. If you, if you, so here at the beginning, there is a, uh, there are some bits, okay. There are some bits in in these flip flops, okay. And if you send new input, new input to here after one clock cycle, okay. So this bit will shift to this one. This I shift I the in, the bit in the input flip flops will move to the M two, no. And M two will move to M one. M one will move to M zero. Then M zero M zero will discard it. Okay, so we have uh, the M2 is replaced by the bit that is in I, okay, and M1 is replaced by the bit that is that was in M2, and M0 is replaced by the bit that was in M1, okay. So you can see that after that clock cycle, you will have I, M2, M1. So this bit will define the next status. Understand? Okay. So try to understand it. Okay. So you can see that this bit, these three bit, okay. These three bit will give the next status. Okay. These three will bit give the next status. So, okay. So here we can fill the next status. Okay. Uh, so you can see that uh, these three are zero. So it is state A. Okay. And this is one zero zero. One zero zero means this one, no? One zero zero is state E. Okay. So this is state E. Okay. So I like if I do this uh, with you, because if I have, if I am doing any mistake, you can correct me. 
okay anyhow 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 i will uh, continue okay uh, <clears throat> uh, so we will try or we will we will see what happen okay so here again zero 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 that is state a okay and here it is one zero zero uh, one zero zero means again state e no sorry um, sorry here one zero zero one zero zero state e no yes it is state e okay mm. yes i hope uh, it is okay then we have zero zero one what is zero zero one status zero zero one is b no this is status zero zero one is b state b okay okay so if i write it here okay so we have m2 m1 m0 okay so we have 0 1 0 1 0 1 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 and here we have 0 0 1 1 0 0 1 1 and here we have 0 0 0 0 1 1 1 1 so eight combination so this is state a this is state b this is c this is b this is e this is f this is g this is h okay 0 1 0 1 0 1 0 1 0 0 1 1 0 0 1 1 0 0 0 1 1 1 1 okay so these are the status okay <clears throat> So let's quickly fill. Okay, so we have uh, zero zero one. Okay, zero zero one means state B. Okay, so you have zero zero one. Zero zero one state B. Okay, then you have one zero one. One zero one means one zero one means state F. One zero one state F. So we have state F. Okay, and here again zero zero one. Zero zero one means state B. Okay, and again you have one zero one. Okay, one zero one means state F. Okay, and you have zero one zero. Zero one zero is state C. Okay, zero one zero is state C, and you have here one one zero. 110 is state G. Okay. And here you have uh, 0, 010. Zero. Zero, 010 zero means state C again. Okay. So here you can see that 110 one, again. 110 one, one, means 110 one, one, means state G. Okay. And you have 011. One, one. 0, 1, 1 is state D, okay, state D, and 1, 1, 1 is state H, okay, and again you have 0, 1, 1, 0, 1, 1 means 0, 1, 1 means state D, okay, and 1, 1, 1 is state H, okay, so you can see <coughs> each, uh, so you can see that uh, there is a, you can see that there is a pattern no? a e a e a e b f b f b f c g c g uh, e, a e a e b f b f c g c g d h d h okay so uh, so we have a pattern okay so most probably this will be okay okay anyway it is better to check uh, one more time Okay.
we hope it is okay okay mm. okay if i am doing any mistake uh, please excuse okay uh, so i think you get the idea no how the status is defined we can do as we like okay and how we define the next status okay that is the most important one okay now we have to we have to check the outputs okay so you can see that okay so you can see that uh, here we have x1 okay so x1 if you see x1 x1 we will have so this input is xor m2 is xor m1 m0 okay so x1 okay x1 we will have input xor m2 xor m1 xor m0 uh, input xor m2 m1 m0 so all uh, these four uh, values will take to count will take to determine the input one okay and input two is so input we get and we get uh, the m2 and we didn't get m1 output and again we get m0 output no m0 output so i m2 m0 okay so these are the two outputs okay so we have to fill that two outputs also okay I hope it is seen. Okay. So I hope this screen uh, is seen. Okay. Okay. So you can see that here uh, the X1. Okay. So we have to we have to XOR all the value. No, we have to XOR all the value to find the X1. Okay. So we will first do this. Okay. So you can see that here 0, 0, 0. So we will have zero okay so you can see one zero 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 that means we have one okay and here also we have zero 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 one and it will have one and here you have one zero zero one so here one 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 again you will get zero because it is xor operation okay and here you will have one and here you will have one zero one zero that means one one again you will get zero okay and here you will have one one that is zero okay and here you will have one one that is zero zero plus one that is one okay and you have one again here it is one okay and here you have one again okay and here you will have zero, okay? And here also you will have zero. And here you will have one, one, zero, zero, one, one, okay? And here one, one, that means zero, okay? Here you have one, one, zero, again one, that is one, okay? Here you have one, one, zero, again one, that is one. And here you have one 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 one. That means one one zero, zero one one, one one again zero. Okay, so you will have this for your x one zero one. Let's 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 take it zero one. Zero, 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 one, 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 zero, 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 one, zero, one, 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 zero, zero, one, one, zero, one, 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 zero, one, one, zero, 
Okay, I hope it is okay. So X2, you have to consider input M2 and M0. So you have to ignore this one. Okay, you have to ignore this one, M1. Okay, and you have to you have to consider these three values also. This three value only, I, M2, and M0. So in the same manner, I will I will uh, fill it. Okay, here we have zero. Here we have one. Okay, here we have one, and here we have zero, one one zero. So here we have zero. Here we have one. Okay, and here also we have one, and here we have zero. Okay, and here we have one. Here we have one one, that means zero, okay. And here we have one one, that is zero. Here we have one one one, that is one one zero zero plus one again one. This is XOR operation, modulo three, uh, modulo two arithmetics, okay. So one one will give you zero, zero one will give you one, okay. Again one, one one, that means zero, okay. 1, 1, again 0, 1, 1, 1, that is 1, okay? So let's check it again. 0, 0, we have 0, uh, 1, 0, 1, we have 1, here we have, we have 0 here, 0, 1, 1, 0, 1, 0, 0, 1, 1, 0, Zero one. Okay, I hope uh, that also okay. 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 So we have filled our uh, uh, table. Okay. So this is the table. Okay. So I get it. Okay. And get it then. Okay, so this is my uh, table. Okay. Okay. I hope you can see my Windows Journal uh, X uh, <clears throat> history. Okay. So this is our table. Now we have to construct the Telis diagram. Okay, actually <clears throat> using this table, you can also find the, <clears throat> using this table, uh, you can also find the uh, encoded bits, okay? But uh, we will try to draw the trellis, di trellis diagram, okay? So it will take uh, much time actually. Okay, anyway, we will try. Okay, so you can see that we have eight status. Okay, we have eight status. I will draw it here. We have eight status. Start here. A, B, C. D, E, F, G, H. Okay, so these are the eight status one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so first we will write all the status here. Okay, then you can see that at the beginning it should be in uh, at the first clock site, it should be in uh, state A, that means zero, 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 all. Okay, so <clears throat> so let's say this is our first uh, cycle, okay, top cycle. This will be our second top cycle. 
this will be our third clock cycle this will be our one clock cycle these are our clock cycles okay so this will be our first cycle and this will be our second cycle this will be our third this will be fourth this will be fifth okay okay so so you can see that uh, so as usual we will use thick lines to denote zero input so, uh, and dash line to denote input one one input one's input okay for zero input we will use thick line and for uh, input one we will use dash line okay so you can see that using this table if the input is a next status also will be a okay so input a the next status also will be in a okay and uh, input is zero okay so the output is zero zero no output is okay output is this two okay this these are the output okay these are the output okay so you can see that okay actually we no need this one for our diagram we need input and output and the status value okay so it is in state a again okay and if the input is one the next is state will be e okay so it should be denoted by dash line okay so here the output is zero zero in this case output is one one okay correct okay so this is a b okay so this is a b the status is again a b okay now you can see that okay so all uh, so you can see for every cycles this will be same okay for every cycle, this will be same like this. Okay. For every cycle, this will be same. No issue. Okay. And you can see that uh, here, uh, now here on, we have only A status. At this clock cycle, we have only A status. Okay. But in this time, you have both A and B. Okay. So we have to consider the B status. Okay. So here you can see that if the input is zero, okay, input is zero, B status will be moved to A, okay. So input is zero, so we will use dash line, okay, and B will be moved to A. So this is A, okay. So these are A, B, C, D, E, F. So here also A, B, C, D, E, F, okay. I'm sorry, that is not uh, going to be this E, no. Okay. Okay, anyway, we will not draw the total trellis diagram, okay, because it will be very time consuming and very boring, okay. So you will not get this kind of big tele trellis diagram for your exam, okay. So this is B, okay, C, D, E. This is C. So this status will be moved to E if the input is 1, not B, okay? Input is 1. So these are also like this. Move to E, move to E, and move to E, okay? Like this, okay? Now you can see that in this case, we have three, uh, two uh, status, and one E status is already okay, and we have to complete this E status also. Okay, so you can see that if we have zero input, so this is the E status, okay, sorry, this is the E status, okay, this two, okay, so you can see that if the input is zero, he will move to e status C, okay, so if the input is zero, so this is the status, okay, A, B, C, D, okay. These are the, this is A 
and this is B, C, D, E, F, G, H. Okay. So you can see that it will move. Okay, it will move uh, from E to C. That means here. Okay, if the input is zero, it will move to here. So what is the output at that time? One one. Okay, so output is one one. Okay, in this case, output is. So I I have forgot to draw the output. Uh, put the output here. When we move to A to E, okay, A to E, okay, A to E, output will be one one, no? one one. Okay, so here the output is one one, and here the output should not be one one. Okay, we have done a mistake. Ah, no, no, it it it, it will be okay. Okay, so one uh, the uh, the same. Input value can be come. Okay, so it is one one again. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, so I have stop. Uh, so one 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 and. Okay, so here also one one. The output will be one one. Okay, and when the uh, when uh, the when when the input is one, the E state move to G. Okay, so E state move to G. So input is okay. So at that time, the input is the output is zero zero. So you will get the output zero zero here. Okay, so. Uh, here also you will get the same uh, value okay here also you will get the same value so on okay and here also you will get the same thing here also you will get the same thing okay okay now if we consider this clock cycle then you have to deal with four status no the a already we have drawn and c we have to draw it considering the input and E already we have draw it. Okay, and G, there are four status. When it comes to this level, you will deal with, you have to deal with eight status, no? Okay, so uh, when you go in further, the, uh, the trellis diagram will be more complex. Okay, the number of status will be increased. But after eight, one, after, after the eight, you will get the same uh, pattern, okay? So this is how we draw the Telis diagram, okay? First we consider the input, then the next is status. So uh, we use, uh, if the input is zero, we use uh, tick line. If the input is one, we use dash line, okay? And uh, yes, dash line and after that, we write the uh, input, the output of the uh, output of the uh, encoder. Okay, on top of the line, we we write the output. Okay, what are the outputs value? Okay, so this is how we construct the Telis diagram. Okay. So let's we try to draw this Telis diagram at least for our uh, at least for our given uh, <clears throat> sequence. Okay, I think we can draw it quickly. Okay, so given sequence is one zero one one one. So you can see that here here we have some dots. Okay, so input will be given from this end. Okay. So our first bit between one and second bit will second bit will be zero and other bit will be one one one. Okay. So we have one zero one 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 so on. Okay. So I will write the status again. Okay. A B C D E F G H okay 
and here also we will have uh, the status okay a b c d e f g h and here also we will have a b c d e f g h and here also we will have a b c d e f g h and here also we will have a b c d e f g h likewise okay yes okay okay so uh, so so now we are in state a okay now you can see the input is one okay input is one so it will move to state e okay it will move to state e if the input is one what is the output one one okay so here it is move to state e sorry state e that is this one so it is move to state e okay so what is the output it is uh, one one okay now we are in state e okay now we are in yeah, sorry now we are in state e okay this one okay output is one now we are in state e okay now we are in state e that means uh, in this state okay we are in this state and you can see that output is zero the input is zero so input is zero if the input is zero we will move to c okay and it is a thick line okay so this is c okay and what is the uh, output e to c that one also one one okay that one also one one e to c that one also one one okay and you can see that now we are in state c okay now we are in state c in this state okay now the input is one so that means this is the, this uh, case. Ne? So input is one, we will move to F. Okay, we will move to F. A, B, C, D, F. So we will move to here. Okay, so we will move to here. So we will have C, F. Okay, we will have C, F. And Um, see if we are f the input is one and we will move to f and what is the output it is zero one okay the output is zero one okay and we will move from f from f to the input is one so we are now in state f this is state no? our current state is this okay and uh, the input is also one okay input is also one and we will move to this case no we will move to g okay and the output will be again one one okay and we will move to g that means here okay that means here and output will be what is one sorry one one again one more okay so likewise we will get the value likewise okay so for this bits we will get one 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 zero one 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 okay so in same way you can find the this bit also okay please check with uh, the answer okay sometime if i have done any mistake okay uh, ah, i think we can check no so let me check
so it will be one one zero one again one one uh, so these are the beats okay i think it is okay no our uh, our one is correct uh, thanks okay so this is the uh, coded one okay So this is the input output, okay? So let me uh, write it somewhere here, okay? It is one 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 zero one 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 zero one zero, okay? So you can see that um, one one, okay? One one, okay? Zero one, that is okay. Again, we have one one, no? One one okay, one one okay. Then we have zero one that is okay again one one, that is also okay, okay. And we have again one zero. That means uh, he counted this level also. Uh, so we will count that level for a while, okay. Oh, no, uh, here I think it is a mistake. No. Here it is one one, okay. Here it is one one, that is okay. And here it is zero one, that is okay. And here it is one one, okay, that is okay. No, okay. If we count the next status, okay. So here we have A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, okay. So now we are in state F, okay. Now we are in state F. I, I, yeah, I write it wrong. Okay. I write it again here. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H. Okay. Now you can see that you are in state uh, G. No, you are in state G. Okay. So this is the state. Now you are in here, state G. Okay, and what is the input? What is the input? Input is one. Okay, input is one. So we have input one, that means this case. Okay, so we will move to the next status H. Okay, so our next status will be H and it is a dash line because it is a, a output, uh, the input is one. And what is the output in that case? It is one zero x one and x two. It is one zero. No, this output. So here again, it is one zero, and this output also will be one zero. Correct? No, it is one zero. Okay, and uh, please uh, do this one also. You will get one zero again. Okay. So I hope it is okay. Okay. Uh, so this is the terrace diagram. Okay, and uh, there is uh, sometime you will ask to draw the uh, status diagram. So it. Uh, will be somewhat easy okay somewhat easy uh, but uh, uh, so you can see that sometime most probably you will have four uh, four status okay for four status if you write the status like this a b c d so it is easy to get easy to uh, draw the state diagram okay you can uh, you can you, you, you can write this anyway, okay? But uh, if we write in this way, you will get a fine diagram, okay? And also you can write uh, it as uh, A, B, C, D, okay? No problem, okay? Then also you will get the value, so A to A, likewise, like this, and here B and C, like this, you will get the uh, state diagram, okay? But in this way, sometimes it is somewhat uh, uh, confusion, okay? If you write this A, B, C, D status like this, you will get a very fine one like this, okay? Like this, as I can remember, okay? Uh, so anyway, it is not mandatory. You can write it anyway, okay? Okay, so if I write the status diagram, so, so I will give idea how I will I will uh, 
give a quick recap how to draw the, the status diagram. Okay. Actually, I have a viva. Now, so it is uh, already uh, passed. Okay. So here also, uh, we will have, um, so we will have A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, right? Okay, so you can see if the input is one, okay, input is one, if input is zero, you will get the A status again. So the output is zero, zero. And if the input is one, you will move to E, okay? And the output is one, one, okay? And if you are in the status B, if the input is zero, you will move to A, okay? You will move to A and the output will be uh, again one, one, okay? And if you are in B and the input is one, you will move to E, okay? You will move to E like this, okay? So at that time, output is zero, zero. So likewise, you can consider all the status and see using this table, you can see uh, what are the next status and what is the output. Then you can uh, draw, you can just uh, join them with the dash line if the input is one or with the thick line if the input is zero. That is all, okay? So I hope you get it, okay? And uh, so uh, I think uh, that is the case. Those are the things we have to do. Okay. So actually, we have to use, we have to find the input output. Okay. So we have done it. Okay. And if I go to the quickly again. Okay. So we have done it, okay. And so this is the state diagram, okay. And uh, here you are given a telis uh, diagram, okay. You are given a telis diagram, okay. Here you are given a telis diagram, and. Uh, uh, Okay, you are given this diagram. Okay, and uh, okay, so all zero sequences transmitted. Okay, so here uh, we have encoded the signal, and uh, the the signal is transmitted. Okay, so you can see that it is a one by two rate. Okay, that means the input is one, and output will be two. Okay, output will be two. So you will have two output here. You will have two output, okay? So for one, so if you send zero, 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 zero bit, okay, bit stream, each for each bit, you will assign zero bit, okay? Any zero bit, we don't know what is the bit, any uh, two bits, any two bits, uh, we have to assign, okay? So, uh, so we have transmitted uh, zero, zero, zero sequence, okay? But we have received this sequence, okay? We have received one zero, 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 one zero, 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 zero. okay? Uh, this kind of sequence you will get, okay? So what we have to do? You have to count the minimum Hamming distance, okay? So you have to count the Hamming distance, okay? If you consider this line, the Hamming distance will be zero, zero, one, zero, that is one, okay? And if you consider this part, Hamming distance is one, one, that is zero, and here the Hamming distance is also one, you will get one, okay? Here the Hamming distance is one, and here also you will get one, okay? And if you consider this part, okay? So here you have zero, zero, and here you have zero, zero. 
then your hamming distance will be zero and you will have one here okay and uh, here also if you consider this line here zero zero and here this is one one so you will have two hamming distance so here one plus two you will get three here okay so i think you can uh, ignore this uh, this one okay uh, and if you consider this one here you have zero zero here you have zero one so here you have one hamming distance so all together you will get two hamming distance okay likewise you have to count the all hamming distance per point then you have to follow through the minimum hamming distance weight okay then you can see uh, the, the the within the line uh, within this line the within the root you can find the input sorry output okay so these output are the decoded one okay so likewise you can decode the signal okay so that decode signal may be without error without error okay so please try it by yourself okay and if you have any uh, any issue please uh, let it let me know before today night then i will do it for you again okay so please try to do this yourself okay due to this time limitation i will stop here okay but any problem you can mail me or you can call me and ask okay so anyway thank you for being here okay